Hello friends, I'm Parviz and today I'm going to show you how you can create a nice paint application in PyQt5. Uh, if you don't know about the basics of PyQt5 uh, and if you're new to PyQt5 then uh, I highly recommend you to watch my uh, videos on PyQt5 uh, basics to advanced. There are uh, about 50 videos in my playlist. Uh, I will add the link to the video description you can watch them uh, and also I highly recommend you to subscribe my channel for further updates and new videos okay uh, now this is uh, the application that we are going to make in this video uh, for example uh, you can see now it is a simple paint application uh, you can draw lines uh, you can uh, clear this and uh, you can, uh, for example, you can, we have brush size, you can change the brush size to 9 pixel and you can see now it is a uh, ticker. Also you can change this to 7 pixel uh, like this. We have a brush color, you can change the brush color for example to read uh, like this. Uh, you can change to green like this. Uh, you can change to yellow and you can change the brush size and like this. Also you can save this. For example, I'm going to save this uh, and uh, in my local disk C, uh, my okay, image image app uh, dot png, you can save it and it will be saved. Okay. Uh, also you can clear your screen uh, like this. This is the application that we are going to make. Now let's get started. Uh, okay, first of all, I'm going to import uh, from Py Qt5 .qt widgets. Import Q application. Also, we need to import Q main window. Okay, now after this, uh, we are going to import system. Import sys like this, and I'm going to create my class class window that inherits from Q main window. Uh, now I need some first of all I'm going to write the constructor dot init. Now I need some parameters self dot top uh, make it uh, 400 uh, self dot we don't need to this cell we can just write top to 400 and left to 400 width to 800 and also height to 600 okay also we are going to give a icon uh, I have icons folder and uh, my icon name is pain dot uh, it's pain okay pain dot png and uh, now I'm going to self dot set window title uh, set dot set window title to uh, I'm going to give this to uh, mm, I'm just give it in here my I give it paint application like this okay now self dot set window icon and uh, I give it to icon like this also let me make my application uh, let's check this I have a window or not f underscore name uh, underscore underscore main underscore app q application system dot argument v and we are going to create our window object window 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 dot show and also app, app dot execute dot execute let me run this Mm, I have a problem. Let me check it. Oh, sorry. 
you should also import from pyqt5.qt GUI import uh, Q icon and in our icon you can simply write Q icon and like this let me run this yeah this is our window also we need to set our geometry so dot set geometry to the top left like this width and height now let me just run this yeah now I have my window parent application with my icon in here after this what you're going to need okay uh, we need some first you need to import a Q image Q image and in the constructor of our application uh, we need to self dot image Q image self dot size also you need to give the format Q image dot format RGB 32 okay and self dot image dot fill by default we are going to make this white uh, let me import the from pyqt5 dot qt core import qt and now qt dot white and also we need some parameters in here uh, the first one I'm going to create a drawing parameter it is a boolean and I make it to false by default so I need a brush size uh, by default it is 2 pixel also I need a color uh, self.brush uh, brush color by default it is black our pen should be black also I need a self dot I'm going to create a point uh, I named self dot last point also you need to import a Q point in here Q point okay now in here a Q point uh, like this now let me run this yeah you can see now I have a nice canvas in here uh, after this now I need to create my uh, menu and menu bars in here uh, for this in here I'm going to create a main menu uh, cell dot also you need to import this uh, Q uh, menu bar and Q menu okay now in here uh, self dot mm, self dot menu bar I've created my menu bar now I'm going to add my file menu and my menu bar main menu dot add menu and I call it file let me just check it yeah now I have file first I'm going to create my okay this was file menu also I need a brush menu main menu dot add menu brush size also I need a brush color main menu dot add menu brush color let me now check this yeah, I have file brush size and brush color now I'm going to add menu items to this the first uh, menu item that I'm going to uh, create okay the first one we are going to create the save menu item I call it save action and this is also you need to import Q action uh, from Q action uh, like this 
let me call it a save action Q action and also I have added some icons to my uh, working directory uh, you can also add icons for yourself I have an icons folder and the first one is save.png and the name is save also self okay also you can create save action dot uh, set short shortcut uh, it is uh, for example control plus s and you can simply add this to your file menu dot add action to our save action now let me just check this okay now I have save uh, with my icon after this uh, we need it was clear uh, clear action clear action uh, Q action let me just uh, copy this uh, because of the video should not be more long it is a clear action uh, the icon is uh, clear.png the text is clear and uh, clear action uh, control C and you can add this now let me check this now I have clear action now we are going to work on our brush we have uh, four kind of brush sizes and uh, let me just copy this again and paste it in here uh, first one is uh, I call it 3px action and uh, I can is uh, 3px.png uh, 3 pixel and just copy this paste it in here for example control T uh, we need to add this in our brush brush menu now just let me check this yeah now I have a uh, 3 pick 3 now just copy this add the 3 more to this another one is uh, I think it was 5 5 uh, Five px dot png make it five pixel and it is control f now just set this and in here also just I'm going to copy this one time more it is for our uh, seven. 7 px action uh, 7 px seven px just copy this and control s now let me just check this we have three five and seven one more we need for our 9 pixel let me just copy this and paste it in here 9 pixel 9px.png make it 9 mm, control n for example and just add this in here now check this okay the brush size completed now we are going to make our brush color uh, for this also uh, for brush color um, the first one was black make a black action Q action, Q icon, uh, 
the icon name is uh, I think black.png icons black.png <coughs> the name is black and self black action dot set shortcut to control plus B also now we should add this to our uh, brush color brush color uh, dot add action black action now let me just check this okay now we have black and but the, uh, we don't have any shortcut to this uh, set shortcut control B yeah control V now just copy this we need for our uh, three more um, I think it was uh, a white the um, white dot png uh, white action change this to white set short shortcut to, to control the blue brush color uh, white just copy this it was white action the, another one that we need is red 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 action white.png read read Uh, now if I run this okay you can see now I have a brush color read but there is no shortcut uh, let me check this mm, yeah copy this and paste it in here after this we need another color let me just copy this and paste it in here it is green green action green.png green control G and the last one that we need is yellow yellow action yellow and just copy this paste it in here paste it in here now let me run this okay uh, now we have black red green and yellow uh, we have completed our menu now we are going to uh, define our uh, events for example mouse press event and mouse move events uh, for this and here uh, the first method uh, that we are going to define is mouse mouse press event okay now remove this arcs and quarks event now we are going to check if event uh, dot button is qt dot left button we are going to make the drawing to true also we take the uh, position of the mouse 
event dot post like this okay and uh, also you can print this if you want uh, let me print the self dot last point just uh, let me make it you can check in here if I run this and if I you can see uh, we have if I click in text mouse position like this okay now let me remove this uh, after mouse press event we need to uh, make mouse move event when we are moving the mouse diff mouse move event remove this and now we are going to check if event dot buttons make sure this is button but in here we have buttons and qt dot left button and let me give uh, in here and self dot drawing if this is the case we are going to make a painter object in here I'll let, I, I think I haven't import this Q image uh, Q painter now in here painter uh, Q painter And give uh, the self dot image. Also, painter dot set pin to. Um, I think I need to import Q pin also. Q pin. Self dot brush color and self dot brush size. Also, you need to give some styles for this. Uh, Qt dot solid line. Uh, Qt dot round cap. Also, Qt dot round join like this. Uh, after this uh, we are going to draw painter dot draw image and we're taking our last point uh, variable self dot last point and even dot pose position like this and after this uh, self dot last point is event dot pose and at then you need to update your screen self dot update okay now let me just run this hopefully uh, yeah we don't get any error but in here we have error uh, let me just check this in self event if event dot buttons and qt dot left button and self dot drawing painter q painter self dot image painter dot set pin uh, q pin self dot brush color self dot brush size qt solid line qt round join painter dot uh, yeah this is not draw image sorry this is draw line, we are going to draw line in here. Yeah, let me just run this. Yeah, right now we don't receive an error, uh, but uh, now you need to uh, make mouse release event. Uh, for this you can simply in here uh, write uh, diff uh, mouse release event and uh, it also removes the arcs and co-works. Uh, just give the event. 
uh, like this. Now we are going to check this. If event uh, if mm, event dot button if event dot button is uh, Qt dot left button. Uh, we are going to uh, make the drawing to false. So the drawing to false like this. Now the last one we are going to overwrite the uh, paint event. Just remove this event. Okay, now we are going to make a canvas painter, Q painter, self, and canvas painter dot draw image, self dot react rectangle, and self dot image and self dot image dot rect okay and now this is our complete code so let me not complete but also we need to make our menu items and now I'm going to just check this that it is working or not and if I you can see now it is working uh, you can draw. Now we are going to first. Uh, we want to make our save save menu item in here. And then uh, we are going to write diff save. And for this, make a file path variable uh, file path. Also, you need to import in here uh, q file dialog. file dialog dot get shift file name uh, self make it like this okay the first parameter is self uh, the second is save image and the uh, third one is blank and also now we can give the PNG uh, dot png also mm, jip pick like this mm, dot uh, gpg and dot uh, jpeg at the end all of files like this okay now we can simply check this if file path is empty then we are going to just return this else uh, we are going to self dot image dot save and give your file path. Uh, for our, let me now just connect this. Save action. Save action dot triggered dot connect solve dot save. Now just run this. Sorry. Uh, I'm going to run this if I draw something and if I save write a name gg for example in my local disk C save now if I check my local disk C um, where is it yeah this dot png okay 
Mm, this was our save. After this, we are going to work on our clear. Diff clear. Uh, for clear, uh, it is easy. You can just take uh, your image and fill that this with the white color. Just simple. Now just connect this also. Uh, where is it? Mm, clear action. Clear action dot triggered dot connect cell dot clear not close. Just run this. And if I draw something in here and clear not working. So save action clear action not trigger dot connect cell dot clear. Solve dot image qt dot oh sorry also you need to update this solve dot update now let me run this now it is cleared and the screen is updated after this we are going to work on our brush sizes three pixel five pixel okay uh, define a new method diff 3px and for this you can simply take self dot brush size and make it to 3 simple now just I'm going to check this uh, the 3 pixel so not 3px action dot triggered dot connect self dot uh, 3px now I'm going to run this and draw let me just 3 pixel now it is taker after 3 pixel I think we have uh, 5 pixel just copy this paste it in here uh, change this to 5 and make it 5 also copy this again uh, 7 make it 7 also copy it once again 9 make it 9 just connect these copy this 5 pixel dot 5 px also just copy this and paste it in here 7 px dot 7 px copy once again this in our 9px dot 9px now just run this if I select 9px you can see now it's bolder and 7 pixel 5 pixel 3 pixel Okay, now we are going to work on our brush color. Uh, for brush color, uh, you can simply uh, we are going to define methods in here. The first one is black. Def black color and self dot 
brush color make it qt dot black now we just copy this we have a white color qt dot white and let me just run this black red oh we don't have white we have just black red and green black red this is red color and dot red and we have uh, green color and we have yellow color and make it qt dot yellow okay now we are going to uh, connect this mm, connect connect yeah first one is black black action dot triggered dot connect so dot black color and we need to just copy this uh, for our read read action and change this to dot read color and just copy this and paste it in green um, just copy this paste uh, green color also we need a yellow yellow action dot triggered dot connect cell dot yellow color yeah now the code completed uh, more than I think 150 lines or 160 lines of codes for our application. Now I'm going to run this. We are going to check this. Uh, now, if I choose a color, for example, read, now it's read. Uh, if I choose green, it is green. And if I choose yellow, it is yellow. Also, I can check the brush size uh, like this and change the brush size like this uh, I can save my image also I can clear the screen okay uh, thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please please subscribe to my channel